Hello YouTube. I haven't made a PMD video in a while. But a bunch of I've gotten a bunch of requests for um about bones. But so before we start that, um this video it's gonna look really easy how you move bones. And I mean honestly it kind of is like when you start moving them, but it gets hard because you have to have it perfect. And if you don't, your model will really, really, really be screwed up, and it's it just doesn't look normal. So please just be careful, and make sure, sure you, your model is safe before you do anything, because if not, you will have to start all over. And for the people who are, like, extremely new to this, the bones are, what gives them physics, and it's a little like, blue dots and lines and, um, orange lines and everything that gives them physics and which means it helps them move so let's begin first we're going to come up here click on this B that's her bone come over here click on the D this will come up make sure the bone is clicked click the VR and yes it will turn green click on the V this will come up click the MA oh and another thing I forgot this also works with bases, as you know, this one I'm using, and pre-made models, which you know, like Miku Haku, blah, blah, blah. And it works the same way for dresses, skirts, clothes, any type of clothes, shoes, hair, anything. Okay, so then click the C, and this will come up. And then optional, if you want, click the S, and then this will come up. It's a subscreen. It makes all the bones and crap go away, so it's easier to see. So now we can be begin selecting the bones. So you want to come back to this box, and basically what you do, you just click on them, find the part that you want to move. So in this case, I'm just going to move her head. And make sure you select everything that is the part where it will completely mess up. So after you've done that, you want to choose somewhere like you know, on this side or on this side left click, hold, and drag, and this box should appear, and make sure you have selected everything. So, after you've done that, I should turn orange, and you want to come back to this box, and you can begin to move it. So, let's say you want to have a longer neck. There we go, she has a super long neck. And you can just click somewhere. And the orange will go away, then come back to here. And just unclick everything so you can make sure all the bones and everything are in the right place. That's what's very, very, very important about this, is to make sure all the bones are in the correct places. So, as you can see, you have the eyes are in the right place, the neck's in the right place. Yeah, I think this is great. And so, yeah, that. That's really all there is to it. Like I said, I know that seems super easy. But if it's not perfect, it will mess up and it will look really bad. So, yeah, that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave a comment, message me. Um, and then, uh, just stay tuned for the next video.